Welcome back YouTube to Rick's YouTube channel. Now the other day, PlayStation updated to 7.02. It's caused no end of problems with people not being able to update their system or it freezes. Now in the previous video, I showed you how to delete the notification, turn off your PS4, restart it and see if the update would download then. But a lot of people are saying they still can't get it to update. So I've got a couple of options for you to uh, try out. First is to manually install it. That means go to settings, scroll down to system software update. It will check for the update. Mine's already installed. It will come up with the update there. Try downloading it again. If that doesn't work, you've got the option to boot into safe mode. That means keep your hand on the power button until it makes two beeps. It will go into safe mode. Uh, then you've got option three where you'd select it and it will download it over the internet in safe mode. And you've also got the option to manually save it to a USB drive and update it that way. So I thought I'd show you how to do that. So I'll quickly back up out of here. We'll go across to the PC now. You can see the current PlayStation 4 system software release is 7.02. And it's been causing problems for the past three or four updates. The big one was 7.00. That caused no end of problems with people not being able to update it. This is 7.02. It's supposed to iron out a lot of uh, system performance issues. So if you read that there, update system software features, main feature in system software includes 7.00 and also 7.01. So if you didn't manage to update the system, you've been offline for that long, you need to get this 7.02 to work. So there's all the, uh, I'm not gonna go into all the features. How to download PS4 system software files. Right, system software update file. A computer connected to the internet, an external storage device or a USB flash drive. So you'll need something like that to uh, download it to with at least 460 megabyte free. So on this page here, it's www.playstation.com slash en slash us support system. Just go on to PS4 update and in the Google search result, it'll be the first site you come up to. Press that, it'll take you to this page here. On the external drive, create a folder named PS4. So you need to create a folder named PS4. Inside that folder, create another folder named update and then download the file to that flash drive. Save your file in the update folder as ps 4 updatepup and that's important. If you get the error SU41350 slash three, cannot find the update file, it means that the pup file was renamed by your computer due to multiple downloads of the same file. So just make sure you do name it ps 4 update pup file or pup. Once you've downloaded the PS4 update onto your flash drive, make sure you boot into safe mode and then you'll pick option three. And option three is update the system software. It allows you to update the PS4 system software via direct download or external storage device. That's your flash drive. So my advice is to try option three first. If it doesn't work downloading over the internet, go over to a PC, get your flash drive, download the update to your flash drive, Boot your PS4 into safe mode and then select option free and then update from external device and give that a go. Any problems, drop them in the comment box below. Let me know how the update went for you. I'll try and help as many people as I can. Remember, I make Fortnite PlayStation videos, so please leave a like, subscribe, and I shall get back to you with another one. Thanks for watching.